So check this out, everybody. On the 1st and 15th of every month, I go on the Yandere Dev WordPress site, and I just check to see if there's an update, you know? So when I check it today, I see this progress report. It says, update coming soon. Yeah, baby. As I stated in a recent blog post, I'm currently doing a checklist of improvements that I want to make to Yandere Simulator. There are five specific checklist items that are all tied to one another, and I knew that I would have to do them all at once and include them all in the same update. I could tell that I was going to be a massive pain, so I postponed it for as long as possible. But at this point in time, there is almost nothing left for me to work on. So on April 17th, I officially began working on five checklist items that are tied to one another. I didn't want to miss a first or 15th of the month deadline, so I worked super hard to complete all five tasks by May 1st. I came really close, four out of five tasks completed, and the remaining task at 80% completion, but I just wasn't able to finish that last task in time to release the build on May 1st. Darn it! I'm really disappointed, but at least the end is in sight, and I know that I'm only one or two days away from completing the update. So, what are you getting in the next update? I'd love to tell you, but I feel like it would be more fun if it's a surprise. All I can say for now is that a lot of different aspects of the game are going to change. However, since I don't want to leave you empty-handed, I'll do this. For every day that passes without me releasing the update, I will release a short video teasing some sort of upcoming content. One of the new features of the next build requires a new animation. While I was waiting for the animation to be delivered, I implemented the feature with placeholder animation, which can be seen below. Okay, so we got Yan Chan's mom standing there, and she's holding a cat in her hands by the neck. Two things I want to say about that scenario. One, that cat better be alive. And two, we better not hurt the cat in any way, shape, or form. But yeah, she's holding the cat by the neck and walking away with that grin on her face that looks so goddamn evil. But it says, poor kitty. Don't worry. The animation you'll be seeing in the upcoming update will be a lot more humane than the one seen above. Okay, better be. What's that? You still want to know more about the next update? Okay, I'll give you a few details. But I'm going to be as vague as possible to avoid spoiling it too much. In the next update, one... 1980s mode rivals are going to be much harder to eliminate. Two, many new types of challenge runs are now going to be possible. Three, various parts of the school environment are going to look a lot different. Four, you won't be able to abuse the game's most broken and imbalanced mechanic anymore. Five, if you love it when the game gets updated with new tasks, you're really going to love the next update. Six, one of the additions in the next build required me to request and add a completely new music track to the game. Seven, one mechanic changed so drastically that I had to update the 1980s mode tutorial to reflect the new way it looks. So while we wait for that update to come out, and the fact that I can't find anything else to play because video games at this moment are drier than the Sahara, I've downloaded the Megami challenge and shout out to Star60 and Monokun for creating this mod. I will link it in the description box below. This is supposedly a very hard challenge, but I did beat Asian mode. Technically I did. I mean, I know at the very end of Asian mode, I did get my cheeks clapped, but I beat it in spirit, okay? But the Megami challenge is supposedly very difficult to beat and I just want to try it out for myself. Maybe I'll beat it, maybe I won't, but we're gonna try our best right now. If you guys cool that you down with that, everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go! Is someone there? Uh, it's you. Why have you come here? Have you come here to taunt me? Do you even know who I am? Okay, so everybody in this school is Megami and they all have attitude. What Got are. it. You know when their arms My are crossed, they got super attitude, right? You are it's like their superpower, active. having a lot of attitude. He has a reason for tolerating your presence at this school. I don't. You are a vulgar creature that is only allowed to exist because you serve a purpose. I like this drone decision, style flying around the school animation. Be exterminated. It's kind of cute. Have fun while you can. Oh, if there you I and am. I ever cross paths. You're going to have a bad time. It says, our objective is to locate and eliminate Megami Psycho. Dispose of all... Man, come on, bro. I just started reading that. All right. So, let me just set this Good bug. Job. Because, I don't know. It was right in front of my face and I felt like doing it. My footsteps were heard. Damn, my bad. I didn't know I had heavy feet like that. So, who is the Megami that I got to kill? I've been spotted. What are you talking about? Let me take a picture of you. You are blocked face. Oh shit, what the heck? I don't understand what I did wrong, so nobody's allowed to see me. I guess I'm just supposed to casually walk and not run because apparently hearing footsteps equals bad. Okay, so we just headed out the room and I'm just gonna walk casually. Look at that face. Oh my goodness, that is the most haunting face that I've ever seen. Does that person even have eyes? Oh, sh oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Hide, hide, because I don't want to be caught. Oh, what the heck? Come on, man. Ain't no way. There's no way! What do you want me to do? So, just because I've been spotted doesn't mean that I failed the challenge. So, let me actually get out of here. Oh my goodness, there's so many people! What the heck? What the heck was that? Yo! 
Ah! Dude, stop. How come some of them are running at me like that? What is this? This ain't the NFL. Okay, I'm gonna get killed. I am going to get clapped Megami style, bro. Hold on. I need to figure out who the real Megami even is. That's not the real Megami. I don't even know who that is. I stuttered too. That's when you know I'm stressed out, when I start stuttering. So I guess I need to find the real Megami. Because all these people look like Megami. Like, they're doing a Megami cosplay. Today is Megami Day at Spirit Week or some shit. So, who is the real Megami, though? Like, how am I gonna know who the real Megami is? Is it RNG? Like, is she different every single time? Because none of these bozos actually look like Megami. So, what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna go get the knife from the cooking club. Because that's what I need to do. So, let me grab that. Thank you very much. <laughs> Wait, there was a knife here the whole time? Oh my goodness. I went to the cooking club for no freaking reason. Nah, bro. I'm done, man. Daddy, chill. What? <laughs> I did not need to see the headmaster in an all-white schoolgirl outfit. I really did not need to see that. Or maybe I did. I don't know. It made me laugh. It was kind of the highlight of my day. Do your thing, headmaster. Like, strut your stuff. You know what? Actually, that's the best part about this so far. I needed that. I actually needed to see that. So, how am I supposed to know who Megami is? Let me try killing somebody. Let me kill you. Let me do that. Oh, wow. Okay, through the door, too. That makes sense. Okay, so I'm sneaking out like this, and I'm still being hunted by Megami, so this really didn't do shit. Look at that. Look at that. They're still coming for me. I'm running. I'm running. I don't care anymore. I do not give a damn. I am just going to keep running. So I think I just have to find somebody that actually looks like Megami. Like that person with the all black hair is definitely not Megami. Are you freaking joking me? Are you freaking kidding me? I'm done with this game, bro. I'm done. How? How did you even get a wig that small? Like I'm telling you right now, that's Megami. That is the most Megami Megami I've ever seen. Mother. Wait a minute. How did I not see that before? Remove aggressive hunters. Okay. I removed aggressive hunters. I don't know how that works, but I'm not going to question it, okay? If a bottle of pills just randomly appear before me, you know I'm going to use it to my advantage, okay? Bro, the counselor is Megami too. The counselor is Megami too. Wait, so that means the nurse is also Megami. I'll check that out once I die again because there's a 99% chance that one of these fake Megamis are going to kill me. So there's actually a shitload of weapons in here too. Hold on. Ooh, okay, so we have a choice of whatever we want, but I can't conceal any of those. So I think this might be the real Megami right here. I don't know. I don't think Megami has hair like that. Yeah, that's not Megami. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's do this. Oh! Wait, now I have another thing. I guess if you suck so much ass, you start getting items once in a while. So this one says, all hunters notify you. Would they let me know that they're not it? Oh my goodness. As soon as I come out, you know why? It's because it's a little laggy. So as soon as I opened the door, I didn't even know she was standing right out there ready to stab. Okay, so Megami Psycho looks like this. So she has the purple hair and then she has the armband on her left side. And she has this whole setup right over here. Okay, so some people have like black hair. I don't think that everybody in this game has that red armband. So those are the things that I'm going to look for to make sure that I got the right one. I think that might be her coming up the hill. Let me actually see if I can get her. Come on, 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 come on. Why? What? It's not letting me kill. That looks like Megami, bro. I can't do it. Why? Why won't you let me kill, bro? So that's not Megami. So I think I can only actually kill Megami. So I know how we're going to find the real Megami, everybody. But it's going to take a little bit of time. And it's probably going to take a little bit of luck. So all these fake Megamis, all they want to do is try to kill you. But the real Megami is going to act like a normal student. So how do we catch somebody acting like a normal student? I think what I need to do is I need to grab one of the weapons inside of like the little trash can area. Put it out for where the real Megami can find it. And then once she picks it up, I finally figured out who the real Megami is. And then we're just going to bada bing bada boom. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a pipe right there. So the real Megami will find it. Because I think that these fake-ass Megamis are not going to do anything, right? So I'm just going to hide back here, and let's wait for, like, the real Megami to be like, Huh, I wonder who left this here. And then once we figure out who it is, BOOM! Who left this here? How irresponsible. I'll take it to the facility room. Got him. Oh, wait, is that a faculty member? Or is that Megami? Either way, Cease gotcha. Oh, crap! That was a student council person! Is that her? That might be her. Hold on. I think that's her. I think that's her. I think that's her. I think that's her. Is it? It is! Yes! Okay. It says I've been spotted, so the technique with leaving something on the ground worked. Okay, so let's pick that up. 
And class begins soon. What do you mean? What are you talking about? All right, dump the body in there. And then let's activate. Actually, let's not activate yet. Hold on, I am not ready to activate. So I keep seeing the ghost of the real Megami appearing right in front of me. But can I actually giggle my way out of this? Okay, I can giggle my way out of this. So let me restore my sanity real quick. Because Megami is giving me judging faces right now as I'm laughing maniacally. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to make my way around. Try to go to the locker room to clean all this stuff up. And then we're going to dispose of everything. And then I guess we either leave or we go to class to finish this challenge. But finding Megami was the hardest part. But once I did like the weapon strategy, everything was easy. It was kind of like we set up a mouse trap. Like I just put that piece of cheese right there and she ate that shit up. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do, everybody. I am going to sneak my way all the way over here. So all the Megamis don't come in here. Please don't. If they do, I'm so screwed. This is going to be so freaking tough if they come here. Please, take off your clothes at your locker. Hold on. I need to make sure all the fake Megamis aren't coming for me. And I think that I snuck pretty good. So I don't think that any of them are here. So let me sneak all the way to my locker real quick. Oh my freaking goodness, that robot scared the shit out of me. Okay. So let's go to my locker real quick. Pick this up. Oh, what? I can't actually do that? Wait, how do I get that? Are you freaking kidding me? I can't grab that now. There's no freaking way. The robot hit the uniform on top of the locker. And now I can't grab it. You have got to be freaking kidding me. You can't make this up. I can't believe I got to do this pinche pendejo again. But at least I know the recipe for success, everybody. All I have to do is bait Megami with a weapon on the ground. And you know that she wants to put that shit back so hard. And oh my... Wait, cloaking device? Okay, how do I do the cloaking device again? There you go. Okay, everybody. So it's about to be 1 p.m., a.k.a. lunchtime in the school. And I'm trying to figure out where she's going. If this game is going to give me the cloaking device for being dog shit at this challenge, then I am going to take the opportunity, okay? So, which one is she again? Oh, my goodness. I, I, I think this is it. Right? That's got to be her. That's her. Okay. So, we figured that out. There you go. And nobody saw us, right? Obviously, because we're wearing a cloaking device. Okay, so let me dump the body. And the evil spirit of Megumi is just standing right there. And then let me dump this. And let me go back to doing what I was doing. I can't believe that I was about to beat this without the cloaking device. But this stupid freaking robot is the reason why I have to restart this. <laughs> okay, so back where we were. So let me carry that. And do not, I repeat, do not try to run, Jay, or the uniform will get knocked out of my hands and the robot may or may not just hit it above into the clouds or some shit. And let's keep doing what we do. So I am going to run. I'm going to run because they can't really get me. They're not about that life. So here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, let's go this way. Why is Megami still standing right there? I have no idea why. That's not the real Megami, right? Okay. Stump that. Come on. Activate. Activate. Got it. And we did it. Escape school's rounds. What? I couldn't see. It did some weird ass animation and then the Megami got me. That doesn't make any sense. Okay. Let's do this again. So we dumped that. And then now we activated that. And now I've been spotted. Oh my God. You've got to be freaking kidding me. Maybe if I just go around the perimeter, I'll be okay. Please tell me I'll be okay. Please tell me everything will be all right. Go, Jay. Go, Jay. Go, Jay. Go! What the heck? Leave me alone, you dollar store Megamis! Go, 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 go. Bro! Please go! Woo! Let's freaking go! Oh my goodness. Thank you. I did not expect them all to run at me like that. No wonder I got killed so quick when I tried that the last time. Alright everybody, but that's gonna do it for this episode of Yandere Simulator. I don't feel satisfied beating the Megami challenge because basically the game gave me a bunch of items because I suck so much that they were like, here you go bozo, here's how you can beat this challenge and they gave me all those items, especially the cloaking device. Like that shit was OP because nobody could detect me no matter what I was doing. But yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed me playing through this anyway. I will see you all in Yandere Simulator again when the update comes out. Hopefully you all enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it one big fat like and tell a friend today that jay from the cub scouts is that dude